sunny days and jaw-dropping plays. The last few months here at Lake Point Sports have been absolutely crazy with a ridiculous amount of talent all across the campus. Welcome into the Lake Point Sports Show. Corey McCartney, Simone Stanley, and we are here to bring you the top 10 plays of summer 2022. At number 10, we have Notre Dame commit Brady Lout getting a strikeout, and then Wichita State-bound Jerson Martin gunning down the runner at second for the strike him out, throw him out, double play for USA Prime National. Yeah, Brady Lout, a big arm, but Jerson Martin showing he's got a cannon strapped to his shoulder as well. Coming in at number nine, we got Redline Hoops, Tyler Lesh hitting the game-winning shot from the corner during the Rise Hoops battle for the Southeast 14U Championship. Uh, just a, some ridiculous stroke here from Lesh kneeling down that three. He knocked down a lot of shots that day, but that was definitely the biggest one for him. So Jace Blaylock is now with the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets, but this past summer he was with the Arkansas Sticks. This guy hit a lot of home runs, but I guess this one was his favorite because he had to stare it down as it left the park. Yeah, this is, goes beyond the bat flip. Uh, Blaylock just, I mean, sometimes you just got to sit back and admire your work. At number seven, we are sticking with the future Georgia Tech bats. Here's 2025 Nico Soul hitting a grand slam for the South Charlotte Panthers, and that bench just absolutely erupting as he went yard. At number six, we have class of 2024 Jake Howlett, who hit two home runs for Team New Jersey in the future games. Yeah, Jake led everybody with those couple home runs, showing off some serious power here. At number five, we have TSF's Camden Andrews hitting the game winning and won during the Battle for Georgia quarterfinals to give TSF the win over the Atlanta Celtics. At number four, we have five star Carolina's Dylan Howe, who had 15 strikeouts in this game during the PBR 15U National Championship. Yeah, Dylan, this, uh, this is a big left handed arm with lots and lots of swing in this stuff. At number three is Sam Momer from the GBR Rays. This kid absolutely had the launch codes, hit a pair of home runs, including a grand slam during the 16 U National Championships. At number two, we have Wood Elite's Chase Tyler. This guy dropped 44 points in the opening game of the Battle for Georgia. Wood Elite is a team that feels like they're underrated, and this guy put on a show, and the coach in the bench just was going crazy all game. Yeah, I think the coach is the best part of this. I, I know they said it's one of the best events, the best games in Rise history, but man, to me, that coach and the reaction just, that makes everything here. And here you have it, the guy who was the king of summer at Lake Point Sports, Tristan Potts from the Canes. A perfect game, 21 up, 21 down with 14 strikeouts during NPI. It gets no better than what you saw this summer here at Lake Point Sports. It's going to be hard for the 2023 summer to live up to this. Can't wait until we get there. Until next time, I'm Corey McCartney. She's Simone Stanley. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.